Aaron, down by four at one point, eventually battled your way back to get the win in the 12. How much of a grind did that game feel like? Uh, it, was, it was it was definitely a grind. Um, you know, we didn't play great, but I give our guys a lot of credit for continuing to compete and really being energized in the second half of the game and just continuing to grind away and find a way back in it and then coming up with a lot of big plays. But, um, you know, so... <clears throat> That was that was a good win, especially from from where we started, and um, a lot of guys um, having a hand in and doing some big things when it mattered. You mentioned guys doing some big things. Gary Sanchez in that ninth inning, nice to see him come up with a clutch hit like that. Yeah, really good. Um, again, good at bats for Gary again tonight. Smoked the ball to left his first time for the out. You know, a big double to get us back in the game with the bases loaded, and then obviously the homer to tie it, but. Um, yeah, so really encouraging to see. And I felt, again, all night, j just more competitive swings, not not chasing, on balance more. So, um, yeah, it, it's, it's good to see that. With Gary in particular, how much different a feel do you have after the last week of at-bats watching him than perhaps weeks prior? Yeah, it's 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 considerably better. It's 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 a different guy in the box right now. Look again, I I don't even think he's necessarily all the way where where I know he can get to, but um, he's in the fight so much more now. He's 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 winning pitches is the way I would put it. Um, even on even in at bats where he's not, you know, getting a hit or getting a result, he's 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 winning a lot of pitches now. And anyone else you'd rather have up in the 12th with the opportunity to drive in some runs, knowing how DJ LeMahieu has handled the bat this year? Yeah, I mean, you know, they obviously looks like they might strand that runner and, and DJ comes in and stays inside one the other way. Uh, yeah, huge hit. Take the next one from Marley Rivera. Hey, Aaron, you've talked a couple of times about how the Yankees Red Sox series doesn't feel the same this year uh, because of no fans. Was there any point today that it felt like the true rivalry? Look, anytime you're playing the Red Sox, you know, there's a, there's a reverence for that rivalry and, 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 and that a respect for that uniform and, and that you want to go out and beat, beat them. But it's different with, without the fan bases. I mean, that's, these are the games you know, whether it was back in New York or now here in Boston, between these two, this rivalry and these fan bases, this is where you notice it a little bit more. And, and that, you know, that, that part of it kind of stinks. Um, but, you know, that said, it doesn't take away from where we are in our season and how important these games are. Um, so you kind of are able to get through that and get over that pretty quick. And in terms of Jonathan Loaiziga, um, the mental strength that he had to come back, how much did that impress you? Yeah, it was great. Um, you know, a little bit of a rocky start there and just kept making pitches. And uh, look, we, we think so highly of him. He's, he's going to play an important role for us if, if we're going to get, get deep in this thing. And these are the kind of situations he, he's going to find himself in. And, and it's not always going to go perfect, but he did a great job of just continuing to battle, continue to make big pitches. And, uh, you know, it was a huge performance by him tonight. Thank you.